Witcher! Coroner wants to see you. Been another victim. Told me to say the main door will be open for you. You're to come as soon as you can. Means bandits dropped them. Played as <laughs> As the black ones are chasing gorillas around the Kedwing woods, Novigrad safe. You, Eustace, the corpse collector? I? How'd you know? Fourth sense, I think it is. You bring Fabian Meyer's body to the morgue. Fabian Meyer. Oh, yeah, I remember. <laughs> no ice, no art. One of them, right? No purse neither, as I recall. One of them? So there have been other bodies like that? Sure have. Beggars, street urchins, and street walkers. One went so portly, I had to cut her into pieces to fit her in me wheelbarrow. Slippery sow, they called her, on account of her. Some things are best left unsaid. What happened to the pieces? What do you mean? Reverend Nathaniel ordered them burned. Every last one. Oh, shame. Shame? Why? Actually, never mind. Another thing that's best left unsaid. You search Fabian's body? Well, I uh, cast an eye in his pockets. <laughs> Made sure nothing went to waste. I call a spade a spade. You rob corpses. And I call a prick a prick. It's none of your fucking concern. What, you tax collector? Peace off, mutant. Talk. What did you find on him? I, uh, as you wish. Triflings, baubles, glass beaded wing, handful of coins, and a letter. Look, vellum, quality parchment, that. <laughs> I wipe off the right inner sill, it is new. That's human skin. Priscilla, next victim's name. If you'd given this to the right person, she might not have been hurt. What the fuck do I care what happens to some Priscilla? We sure are wenches in this town. Get out of my sight. Now. Geralt, right? I'm glad you're here. Held off on the autopsy till you arrived. Nice of you, especially given you didn't seem pleased about my previous visit. Because you came unannounced and in unfortunate company. I also had Reverend Nathaniel to contend with. Our spiritual caretaker has left the city on some important matter. And I know who you are, what drives you. I'm more than happy to aid your investigation. By the way, you and Von Gratz don't exactly get along. Why is that? I had him sent to prison. You see, Joachim led the student protests in 1242, a senseless and brutal revolt. People were dying, Witcher. Those who rejected liberty, equality, and fraternity would be found in the gutter come morning. Their throats slit from ear to ear with surgical precision. Joachim had been my favorite student, but alas, I had to do something. So I reported him. Then I left the university and found work in the morgue where none care about my past. Whereas Joachim, oh, fate's ironies. Years later, he was appointed head of the very ward I had founded. How old's Von Gratz? Fifty? Sixty? Fifty-three, I believe. Why do you ask? You look a little young to have been his teacher. Not surprising. For years, I've lived in the cold and dark, breathing the vapors of embalming fluids. In short, working with corpses extends one's life. Amusing, is it not?
Not fond of Nathaniel? Very few people are. He's cruel and capricious. He stormed in here once, grabbed a scalpel I was sterilizing over a burner, sliced my back with it to the bone, because I had forgotten to lock the storeroom. Hard to be fond of someone like that, wouldn't you agree? Who's the victim this time? Joris Aquinas, a lecturer in theology at Oxenfurt Academy. Found this morning at his home on a catafalque made of his books. Any titles in particular? It seems all the tomes dealt with the eternal fire. Treaties critical of the faith's doctrines. Yeah, mortal sin in Novigrad. Let's start. Gladly. The wounds conform to the killer's modus operandi. The victim was bound and forced to drink formaldehyde. Next, the killer removed the eyes, placed burning coals in the sockets, then opened the ribcage and... What's this? A parchment made of human skin. A message from the murderer, the name of his next victim. Patricia Vagelbud. Do you know her? Yes. Even went to her estate once with... Gotta find her, now. Till next time, Master.